homie. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit, man. Oh uh, man, where else do we wanna go? Oh shit, yo. So, uh, what did you do on Christopher Columbus Day? I was talking about bullshit. Not a goddamn dog. I think I went to work <laughs> and celebrating that bullshit holiday. Well, I did see the news where some of his statues got vandalized. Yes. Red paint and shit like that. Yeah, mass all over the fucking nation. Shout out to everybody with some fucking red red paint, man. Yeah, shout out to everybody that got knowledge. For real, they woke as fuck. <laughs> Hell yeah, nigga. I was like, uh, yo, so on uh, Christopher Columbus Day, nigga, right? We should just fucking, you know, barge into somebody's house and say, yo, we own this shit. Yeah, man, I, I just, I come up off my couch. For real. <laughs> my TV looks really good from that, from that position. Yo, facts. <laughs> That's 100%. Hey, you bitch, get off my keys. I drive your Audi better. Yo, That's for real. Audi. <laughs> hey, yo, nigga, what you doing, nigga? Give me a bitch. <laughs> yeah, man. I was sleeping in your bed. I, 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 I'm amazed how sensitive the white folk was. What about everything? No, I'm just talking about that particular issue. Nigga, if they're mad about a black mermaid, <laughs> yeah, they're gonna better, go off on this you, shit. Oh, yeah, you better know it, man. Yeah. Nigga, these motherfuckers are crazy, man. I mean... <sighs> but that's the truth. Hey, anybody out there who wants to know, you know, do your research, nigga. Go, go Google. Go on the... Go do the books. You know what I'm saying? Like... Learn the history, nigga, about fucking Christopher Columbus. A real dubious individual, that's for sure. Niggas are... Yeah, niggas are fucking clowns. He fucked you up. He fucking shit up. Hell yeah. But it's not even just Christopher Columbus Day, nigga. It's like a lot of holidays. Mm -hmm. You know? Can't yeah. wait to fucking finish my holiday set. But <laughs> there's so much bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Like Christmas. Like, they, they we supposed to be celebrating... That's not Jesus' birthday. Jesus was born around October. For oh, real. I mean, we supposed to be... They make it so commercialized and... Commercialized and... Yo, they commercialize everything. Like, Black Friday and shit. Why Black Friday gotta be where you spent all your money, God damn it? I know. Why is Black gotta be fucking half off? How come everything Black... Everything Black gotta be cheap. How come Black Friday can't be the day where you, where you get taught financial literacy? Oh, no, that's fact. It says spending because, all your goddamn money. Yeah, because it's a scam, nigga. Like, we commercialize everything in America. Like, I'm not shocking, nigga, that there's not a 9-11 fucking sale. Mm. You know? Mm. Come on down. Those prices, just like those towers, are going down, down, down. Wow. That's fucked up. Yeah, it is. Or it's like Martin Luther King and shit. They sell mattresses and shit. An MLK mattress? Yeah. You can, you too can have a dream wow. on these contrapedic mattresses. <laughs> <laughs> That's some bullshit. That that would be dope, though. That would be dope. If, yeah. Tom, if Tom Brady could sell a mattress, I know MLK could. Oh yeah, facts, facts. That's a hundred percent. That's a hundred percent. You know, and it'll be all the white people, nigga, that feel bad, nigga, about the, you know, the racism shit. That'll buy a lot of them shits. Just to feel like, you know, we're doing something. <laughs> <laughs> we're giving back. I apologize for my ancestors, but I wasn't there. So why are you hating me? No, no, no. White people do that all the time. I was like, nah, you just look like them. <laughs> yes. I know you got their tendencies under the surface. It was like, fuck. No cap. Nah, but this was fucking crazy, though, man. But, yeah, nah, like, it's just like, you know, Thanksgiving and shit. It's the same shit. Mm -hmm. It's coming up, too. It's just people been so trained, nigga, you know, by tradition to keep doing that shit. They've been doing it programmed year after year. They've been doing it since. And and they throw family in there, too. Yeah. So it's like, oh, it's, you know, it's just getting the families together. That's what that's what Thanksgiving for me is more now. Mm -hmm. Just the getting together with your, with your king folk. Yeah, but it's crazy, though, like, how, like, it has to the take, football. nigga, either death or a lie to get niggas together. That's the fucking truth, man. Like, that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, that's too. fucking crazy. Because no one just, you know, just goes down there just to see you. No. Or whatever. Unless, you know, they need, like, yo, my nigga, how you doing, man? It's been a minute. So, yeah, can you help me out with this loan? <laughs> <laughs> like, I need a couple of hundred. <laughs> for real. I was like, damn, nigga. Fuck. I need you a know, couple hundred, for sure. Check up on it, nigga. Oh, yeah, man. I don't know, man. You Thanksgiving, know? Thanksgiving, I never thought... Thanksgiving will be commercialized, but it is. 
Now it's just mm-hmm. about the football game, the basketball game. Yeah, the yeah. Ticket. again, they know. I, I look at Christmas just as an NBA day. Yeah. So I'm just sitting home watching the game. Oh, yeah. You know? There's no football on Christmas, right? No, 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 no. No. It's all NBA, Christmas day. Yeah. I love that shit. Now, they always have some good ass games, too. That's what be lit, though. I was watching NBA game six. 98 finals, the flu game. Oh, oh, you mean the the hangover game? Yeah, Michael Jordan pushed that nigga off. Man, that nigga was drunk as shit. <laughs> That's how you know he's the GOAT. LeBron ain't got no hangover game. No. He ain't got no flu game, no hangover game, no nope. push-off game. But nope, he got, a, he got a choke game. He got a couple choke games. Yeah, he does. I was like, nigga, I haven't seen choking nigga like that nigga since fucking Pornhub, nigga. Wow. When I see nigga in that fucking Dallas shit... I was like, yo, hey, I, I, I was happy, man. I was a Dirk <laughs> fan, man. I'm glad he got a ring. <laughs> I, I, was, I remember you being pissed off. Because he was like, yo, Miami going to beat him. Yeah, I yeah everybody thought that. I thought that shit, too. I just thought they was going to win. They, they went down there got beat by a better team. Yeah, and, uh, that's facts. Because they was more together. Not talent-wise, but they was just more together. Yeah, they played better together, yeah. That, that's what it all comes down to. Yeah, man, NBA preseason, man. Let's get into that shit. The Knicks looked impressive. The Lakers look ready to go. Yeah. The Pelicans are going to be fucking the shit. Yeah, nah, nah. They're going to be pretty entertaining, man. Zion's fat ass. <laughs> he look, nah, he look good. He look good out there. I, I, like, the way he moves at the size he is, mm-hmm. is incredible. Yeah, Because he got that old orangutan body. Yeah, he is all low to the ground. Dude. Yeah, all yeah, nigga. Like, he look like he dragged his knuckles when he walks. That nigga look like, yeah. He look like he could like play like... Like he look like he could play defensive tackle, right? Yeah, now. nigga, like a football player. That's 100%. He's yeah. a big boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he can move. It's like, wow. Imagine like what he'll look like when he lose weight. If he lose weight, yeah, he might yeah. just get bigger. Yeah, yeah, all that fucking jambalaya nigga in New Orleans. He like shot, just get bigger. Yeah, facts. That's facts. It's six foot nine, 300 pounds. Big nigga. Oh, my God. But, um, the, I saw the Rocket game. They look good too. Yeah. They look good, but you have to get used to watching um pardon me. Um Westbrook, Westbrook and, and Jersey. It, yeah, you gotta look just them two together, Harden and Westbrook together, you gotta get used to that. They gonna fight. Oh uh, well Harden still did him. He got forty he dropped. He always 40. gonna do him. It's his team. Yeah, he did He's 40. gonna have the ball most of the time. Yeah, he got forty but but Russ got like nineteen and five. Yeah. The Knicks didn't look half bad. The Knicks? No, no, no. You guys got, like, good veterans, like, respectful veterans. Like, they got a good mix. Yeah. You got my nigga Marcus Morris on there? Yeah. He, he said he's not going to let these uh, the Knicks look like a joke. No, they they, they, they uh, they serious. They played better defense last night. Nah, they, lost, they only lost by, what, two? But the yeah. way they played was our own point. The Knicks are making progress, man. Sweet Jesus, thank God. Finally, only took, what, three decades? <laughs> Shit, yeah. God damn. That's that's terrible. Three decades of a, a shit full of bad trades and even more yeah. drop mismanagement of yeah. uh, the money, giving Melo all that money. <sighs> they had to try. No, 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 they did, they did, they but did it's just they gave him so much money that they couldn't really build shit around him. No. Nope. But again, nah, it's so much shit with that. It, you know, there's so many things, the what ifs, yeah, and mm-hmm. things that should have happened. Absolutely. But it's all good. What is it? I'm going to say this. I know my nigga was, uh, me and my boy was talking about this shit yesterday. I know, if you're hearing this, my nigga Gil, you wrong, as I told you. Celtics going to fucking surprise motherfuckers. Yes. He was all like, yo, nigga, but they're not going to be Philly. It was like, yeah, I, okay, I give you that. I'll give you that. I don't know if this is still going to be the same team after the, the, um, the trade deadline. Mm-hmm. I don't know, but... I'm looking at Kemba, Brown, Tatum, and Haywood. I'm looking at that four. You got, like, four guys in your starting lineup that could go for 20 or 30 any night. And we got at any given time. And multiple, and one of those two are going to have it on the same night. Like, at least 20. Yeah. You know? And then, like, I'm looking at, like, the preseason games. They play solid defense. Yeah. They blew out three of the last games. They were undefeated in the preseason, even though they 
playing like you know like you know lottery teams, but still, yeah, they good habits and shit. This guy, what is it? Um, Carson Edwards came off the bench, dropped eight threes in five minutes. <laughs> like this nigga, little nigga too. That ain't no joke either. Nasty nigga on some Steph Curry shit. I was like, yo, this team's gonna surprise motherfuckers. Yeah. Third, fourth seed. Easily. I can see. Easily. I can see. Especially in the East. The East ain't too bad. It's wide open now. But yeah. Philly's gonna be where it's at, though. Yeah, nah. I'm Embiid, Horford, Ben Simmons making jump shots now. Yeah. It's like, what the fuck? Yeah, he, he, that was the final. That was the missing ingredient. Yeah, he needed that. Now he get his own shot, he's good. Yeah, it's like, fuck! <laughs> now you don't need no, you didn't need Jimmy Butler. Yeah, nah, 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 that, that was kind of forced. Yeah, because he didn't have a jump shot. You know, I think Tobias Harris is a perfect fit for them. I don't think I know, I don't know his game like that. Yeah. But, from what I understand, he's nice. Nah, he is, like, he played like a little, like, mellow. Okay. A little bit. Ooh. But he, he fits right with him because he can shoot. He can put the ball on the floor. He can post up. He get his own shot. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, nah, he's good. He's good. And he he's a better shooter than Jimmy Butler. So it just, it works better. And they picked up Josh Richardson. So it's just like, fuck. They got a pretty good squad, man. Fuck. <laughs> nice, dog. Fuck, man. Nice, now, when your dog. rival gets nice, man, it's like, fuck, man. Yeah, you feel it to your soul.
the project is not a hip hop museum. All right. Yeah. Like like T.I. is making a oh he made a um a trap music museum down south. Really? Yeah. About it's mainly about like you know southern hip hop. It starts with outside. It's pretty dope. It, 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 it's uh uh Jeff on the crew. Mhm. But it's talking about more like you know like the trap music. Oh, that didn't start coming around to until T.I. Yeah, the album trap music. Mhm. You know. Talking about like niggas like Jay Z and shit like that, you know. I think uh, Two Chains probably in there, like, and there's probably a lot of other people that we don't know because we're not from Atlanta, you know. But so shit like that. But yeah, hip hop needs their own fucking you know rock and roll. I mean, hip hop rock and roll. They need their own fucking Hall of Fame. That would be dope. They would have to go and find Mm -hmm. anybody that was down with season one hip hop. And make sure all of them niggas get in. Yeah, yeah, for real. Nobody should be left out. Especially that generation one. Yeah, that's a hundred percent. That's a hundred fucking percent, man. Oh shit. Uh, uh where else you want to go with, with this? Mm. Uh, a lot of topics. Let's see. You man walk three. Man walk. Man long. Oh yeah, y'all. <laughs> I don't know, man. There's just some crazy motherfuckers out here. But you know what was really crazy, man? I was reading that it kind of, I don't know, like, I found it funny at the same time. But at the same time, nigga, it was like, damn, nigga, that's kind of fucked up. There's um, three women at a nursing home. Like, they work at a nursing home. Yo, they secretly started a dementia fighting club. That's so fucking funny. That's <laughs> Yo, that would be a funny-ass skit. <laughs> Remember shit? What? That would be funny as shit. <laughs> niggas all fucking the shit out of each other. Yeah, man. A man get punched in the face and then niggas forget what he do after that. Like, what do you really? do now? Like, you broke a niggas jaw and shit. Well, what happens now, my father? Who's that? That's crazy as hell, dog. Like, I saw that shit. I was like, yo, that's funny as fuck. That's fucking, that's bad as hell, man. That's so fucking bad. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> like they was really like rounding people up and shit. But another thing, I'm thinking like, damn, that could have been my fucking grandpa. <laughs> Easily, right? You know what I'm saying? With that bull and that bullshit, did whoever did that need to get the chair, nigga. Like that also got me thinking like, damn, nigga, like who the fuck did these nursing homes be hiring? That's real. See, look at these three black women. Come on, Swiss gang. Y'all fucking up. Yo, for real. Like, what the fuck y'all doing? They probably were taping that shit and gonna... That's cool. No, nah, no, nah, but... Oh, this shit was in, um... North Carolina. Yeah, they... They, they gonna make an example of that. You can't do no shit like that down there. That's facts. You can't do no shit like that anywhere, but not down there. Yeah. We asked you for it. It's so like, when these people get, like, injured, like, what are you saying? Like, are you saying, like, oh, they just fell... Maybe because the people forget. You be like, I don't know. That motherfucker walk around like crazy all the time. I you know he be bumping into shit. Exactly. That that's what I would do. But I'm like, yo, that's crazy though, nigga. Like, I don't know. That shit's just mad funny though. Niggas over there punching each other and shit, and then just forget about it like like five minutes later. That's so fucking bad. <laughs> that's so fucking bad. Oh my god. That's so crazy. Oh shit, man. That's funny though, man. I don't know. The world never ceases to amaze me. Nothing surprises me either, man. Nope. I was like, when I saw that shit, it was like dementia fight club. Like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> that had to be that. That was wild when I read it. I can't lie. <laughs> that was fucking wild when I read it. Yeah, nigga. It's like, it yo, was, man. These mo- like nobody has no boundaries, no chill. After hearing that, hell no. That's just like to catch a predator and shit like that, man. Yo, yeah, nah, facts. That's that's just crazy, man. It's like, nigga, what the fuck you doing? <laughs> I'm like, yo, like, like this nigga, right? This nigga walks 351 miles to have sex with a teen teenager. She was like 16 years old. I'm like, nigga, like, what the fuck are you doing, nigga? Like, yeah. you walk 351 miles? He couldn't find a, a grown woman with a bus pass. Nah, for real. <laughs> like, what the yeah. fuck? 
I don't know, man. Someone you like, can't afford an Uber, nigga? And you trying to fuck? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, wow, man. That's crazy. What do you say to that shit, man? God damn. That's fucking crazy, man. That's crazy. That must be some good. I hope it was worth it. Mm-hmm. Like, like, at least let it be worth it. Like, if there was a bad bitch, she's young, but at least. Yeah, yeah, nah, nah. Don't let it be, like, no honey boo boo looking bitch. Yeah, or just. You know what I'm saying? Or, or underdeveloped, not even worth, like. I, don't, I, I can't even understand. I'm trying to fucking lock this. To lock trying to make, yeah, trying there. to make sense. But no, it's just bad all the way. As soon as she got in the car and went her way after mile two. Nigga, mm-hmm. he walked on foot. Oh, my God. He walked on foot, nigga. That's you what I'm saying. He, he was like, not a drive. You said 381 miles? 51. Like, it makes a difference. Well, it's like... <laughs> That's the only thing. Miles, but let's see. Let's see. Let me do the math. Uh, you